after the financial crisis, um, we had like an early retirement program that staff could take, and it was it was voluntary, and a number did of them did, and I had this practice of um, going to shake everybody's hand, and I, I gave them a Tiffany pen that said Harvard Graduate School of Education on it. So I was way in the back, you know, behind the circulation desk in the library, and um, it was vast. <laughs> There was a lot of real estate back there, and I I walked out and I said to um, Bob Fogel, "I'm gonna I'm gonna change the space here." So we met with an architect, and I said, uh, "We need we need a cafeteria here." Remember, we had the cafeteria in the basement of Longfellow, yes, it where was tiny. it was tiny. You couldn't sit there. Um, and in the beginning, you know, we put the teak furniture outside to create community, and that was okay as long as the weather was good. But we knew we needed community space. We knew we needed a cafeteria. And we started talking with this architect. Is there any reason we couldn't move the circulation desk up to the second floor? But, well, you might lose a few books, but it's worth it. We decided it, it was worth it. So um, we got going on it. And, um, you know, it was a very creative architect, I thought. Um, I, I just think it transformed the campus. I, I couldn't believe it. Even after I went to Smith, people would sometimes send me letters thanking me for Gutman Commons. <laughs> I got um, one staff person took a, a picture of um, his feet on one of the fireplace hearths and sent it to me saying, enjoying Gutman and thinking of you, which was just so, so nice. Um, but it did. It, it just transformed the campus. People started having meetings there, like faculty, yes. instead of meeting students in there, Offices were saying, hey, let's meet over a cup of coffee in Gutman Commons. Um, I don't know if you know this, but um, when Drew was doing her public spaces project, there was an architectural group, a group of consultants who came over and looked at all of this public spaces on campus, and they told Drew that Gutman Commons was the best place on campus. Oh, that's The great. best one at the time. <laughs> Drew has right. certainly built some amazing ones, like right. this Smith Center and so on, but... Right. And Gutman uh, Commons continues to attract community members from all over Harvard. Yes, I know. Everyone wants to eat there. This yes. uh, It's like a Starbucks on steroids. <laughs> it really is. <laughs>